to my mom's office to pick up a package for her and i'm here with little mila um i'm actually recording on my phone i didn't bring my camera today and i'm recording in 1.5 or is it like 0.5 so hopefully this doesn't look totally crazy but yeah okay guys so i just got to my mom's office it's kind of bright but i feel like i want to record without my glasses i just got to my mom's office to pick up the package i got here before ups so i'm just gonna wait for them so i can sign it little mila is also here she did not want to sit in her own seat on the way here so i had to hold her um also i want to take this time to explain to you guys where i've been because i said i would be, I would be more consistent and i have not been so basically I graduated in May of 23 from college and I didn't know what I wanted to do so I decided to be a stay-at-home daughter for a while and then I decided I wanted to go to pharmacy school because at first I wanted to be a surgeon and that's like an additional 13 years of school and I was like that's just not gonna fly honey I'd be like 30 maybe like 32 when I graduated and I was like I don't want to be in school my whole life so then I was like, okay, I still want to be a doctor, so what can I do? And I was like, okay, I'll be a pharmacist because I worked at Rite Aid. I think I posted a video about it, but I worked at Rite Aid during undergrad. And I mean, pharmacists are pretty cool and they're still doctors. So uh, the school that I graduated from actually has um, a new three-year pharmacy program. And it's like a doctorate program. So it's like a farm, what do they call it? A farm D program so when I graduate I'll be a doctor and it's only gonna take three years so that's what I decided to do oh hopefully I don't know when I'm gonna post this video but hopefully I want to post it after I mail out my invitations to my white coat ceremony so um, I guess I didn't say whether I got accepted I got accepted into pharmacy school and um i already had my interview and everything so now i'm just waiting for orientation which starts july 10th so it's coming up quick and my white coat ceremony is july 12th so i want to mail out invitations for everyone everyone and i don't want them to know they're getting invitations i want it to be a surprise but i've been working on what i want them to look like because i have them customized and i know exactly what i want them to look like somewhat i've kind of been struggling on the design so when i get home i'll show you guys what i've been working on and i think they're super cute so i'm gonna include the invitation a details card and then an attire card because i kind of want everyone to be wearing something similar like everyone to be wearing like spring colors like no black fedex is here but i'm waiting for ups yeah i'm pretty sure i'm waiting for ups but um Maybe I should get out and check. Hold on guys, I'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm back. So that was not my package, uh, but the lady, she did verify with me. Cause I think she's the woman who usually drops stuff off to me. So she came up to my car and was like, I don't know if this one is for you. Cause like your mom's business isn't on it. So I was like, probably not. Cause I'm waiting for UPS, but she was very nice and very helpful. But back to what I was saying, I was just telling you guys about my um, invitations so yeah when i get home i'll show you guys exactly what i've been working on um other than that i plan on being more consistent i plan on recording my whole white coat ceremony my whole journey in pharmacy school so hopefully you guys can come with me and see what i'm doing and i'll grow my channel and you guys might be curious about mila she's not actually mine she's my mom's dog but we spend a lot of time together so i will miss her when i go off to school but i still have copper so he'll be with me um and yeah that's pretty much it so when ups gets here i will record it and then when i get home i'll show you guys what i've been working on okay guys so i'm still waiting for ups um it's 10:08 now they said they'd be here between 9 and 12 but i figured they'd be here earlier rather than later so um me and mila are just sitting here waiting um i just wanted to give you guys a little update um that's it i'm also kind of bored so i've been trying to like figure out what to do so i've been watching like some videos on ideas of ways to edit because i haven't edited in so long and i edit on final cut pro so it's kind of hard so i've just been trying to like learn new skills and stuff like that but yeah we're just sitting here waiting okay guys i'm still waiting but i was literally starved so i went to mcdonald's and i got a 10 piece and some fries so 
I'm gonna sit here and eat. I have a feeling they probably won't be here till like 12. So I have like an hour left. So I'll let you know when they get here. Okay guys, so I totally forgot to record when the guy dropped off the box to me, but I got it. And I decided to record because I was at a red light, but then the light turned green. So now I am on my way home. And I don't know if you guys can see, but the box is behind me. So um, when I get home, I'll open it with you guys. It's a CeraVe box. I guess they sent like some samples and stuff. They've sent them before. So they sent them again and we're gonna open it together and see what's in there and see if there's anything that I like. And yeah, so I will see you guys when I get home. Okay guys, I made it inside. It's literally so hot. Oh my goodness. I just got home. I let Mila go out and pee first. Then, I don't know if you can see Carter, he's down there. I had to take him out and it's literally just too hot to be outside, but I'm about to show you guys the survey box. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm, I apologize if you can hear Copper's heavy breathing in the back. But here is the CeraVe box. Looks like they have like a lot of good stuff in here. There's like some coupons and the stuff. Okay, so they have the acne control cleanser. I probably need that because my skin is acting out right now. And this is the moisturizing lotion. This is my favorite thing that they always put in here. The healing ointment, literally my favorite. Um, renewing SA cream. I don't know what this is. Renewing SA cream. They also have this itch relief moisturizing cream. Uh, so they have like some new things in here that I haven't seen before. So that's pretty cool. Hi guys, this is voiceover Najee just popping in. So here I'm just showing you guys all the designs I came up with for my invitations to my white coat ceremony. So I had like a whole bunch of designs and I couldn't decide which one I liked best, but I ended up going with the pink one with like the princess crown. And then for my uh, details card and attire card, I kept them all pretty similar, like the same color scheme. And that black line, it did not stay. I just needed like to know where to cut. But yeah, this is what I came up with for my invitations. Hi guys, it's a couple of days later and I am at Myers. I'm gonna make a couple, well not a couple, I'm gonna make a DIY um, first white coat hanger and then I'm gonna make one that says doctor with my name and then I'm gonna make one for my sister with her credentials because she's going to nursing school. So I'm here at Myers. I need to get E6000 glue. I need to get some more pearls because the ones I ordered, it just wasn't as big as I thought it would be. And I need to get some double-sided tape. Uh, Mila's also here with me, so I'm going to take you guys with us and see what we can find. Okay guys, so I found the glue, but I'm not sure if I should get the Scratch Super Glue or the E6000. Uh, the Scotch one has like a better tip. And the pearls are small, so I don't want to get the E6000 and then it's hard to apply. Okay guys, so we just came back outside from Myers. I found everything I need and I'll sit you guys down somewhere and give you a little haul of what we got. We only got three things, so it's nothing crazy. I got the double-sided scotch tape. I also got the glue. I couldn't decide between this and the E6000, so I ended up getting this one because the applicator is smaller and I think it'll be easier to get onto the small pearls. The one thing I didn't find in there was additional pearls, so I may have to go to like Hobby Lobby or um, what's the other one called? It starts with an M, Michaels. Either Holly, Holly, Hobby Lobby or Michaels. And then this is the pink ribbon I got because I think I want it to go around like the little hook. And I also decorated my purse and I want to show you guys. I think it's just the cutest thing. I could have decided if I wanted to add like um, a chain going across, but I don't think I'm going to. I think it looks pretty nice and simplistic the way it is already. 
But other than that, I'm just gonna head home. I was thinking about stopping at the dollar store to see if they had the pearls, but they more than likely don't have them and I'm already a little bit tired and I have an exam to take today. So I think I'm just gonna head home and get something to eat because I'm also starved. <laughs> since I've been vlogging but I've been trying to vlog consistently all week so I just wanted to stop in and show you guys what I'm doing today also I look a little crazy because I woke up like an hour ago and I just brushed my teeth and washed my face but I didn't like put on any clothes yet so I'll probably do that later but um I just wanted to stop in and tell you guys what I'm doing so today I am finishing the personalized hangers for me and my ow Mila that's rude for me and my sister and um right now i'm just putting the pearls on all the letters which is the most time consuming part and i also ran out of ribbon so my mom went to get me some more so when she gets home i can finish that part and um other than that i don't think i really have any plans today uh yeah i think that's pretty much it so i just wanted to stop in and say hi to you guys and yeah, also, I need to add the wax seals on my invitations to my white coat ceremony. So I'll show you guys those because I think they turned out super cute. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I didn't really film a proper outro or a proper intro but regardless I hope you guys really enjoy this video and I hope to see you guys next week I need to not pick up my phone I'll go straight to airplane mode find something to do I know I can be a little bit cold but my third eye is going blind I'm on a